right, how to draw an oval in SketchUp. So first, I'm going to start with a circle. So C for circle. And I'm going to draw out my circle. And then I'm going to hit S for the scale tool, select it, and then click and just drag it out. And there's your oval. Now if you look at it, when you stretch out your circle, your segments get super jaggedy. So let's uh, triple click and delete that. So we're going to go C for circle, and instead of the standard 24 signs, the default 24 signs, I'm going to type in 60 and hit enter. So now I have a 60 sided circle, so that will give me a smoother oval. All right. All right, so now let's say you want an oval of a certain size. Let's say you want it to be 10 inches tall and 6 inches wide. So I'm going to hit R for rectangle and I'm going to draw a 6 comma 10 enter so I'm going to triple click that uh, and right click make it a group all right and then I'm going to use my tape measure tool T for tape measure and snap to the center point so now I have a center starting point so I'm going to hit C for circle and I'm going to drag it out select that S for scale, all right? And now if you look down here, it says control to toggle about center. So I'm gonna hit the control key and snap to my edge of my rectangle. And now we can delete the rectangle and then there is our uh, 10 by six oval. All right, so now one other cool thing, let's say we wanted to go, uh, draw a golden ratio or a golden oval. So if we use SketchUp to snap to a golden section, hold the shift key down and draw that out however big we want it to be. And now triple click and we'll make it a group. I have a shortcut key shift G for group, uh, T for tape measure. Snap to our center points. C for circle. Draw it out, snap to the edge of our rectangle. I'm going to select the edge, S for scale, control to toggle. All right, and now there is our oval that has the same proportions as a golden rectangle. All right, let's delete that. All right, so one more thing here. I'm going to have T for tape measure. I'm going to go out here a little ways right on my other guideline. Just so I have something to snap to. I'm going to hit L for the line tool. And I'm going to delete half of this. All right. C for circle. I'm going to hit the left arrow key to lock onto my green axes. So that way I am perpendicular to my oval. All right. So I'm going to select my circle. Use the follow me tool. And then there we have kind of an egg shape. Even though it's not as oblonged as an egg. Egg usually has a fatter bottom and a skinnier top. But... Uh, there you go.